ओके एवरी वन वेलकम बैक टू अ न्यू फैमिली ब्लॉग टूडेज ब्लॉग इज गोइंग टू बी रियली फन फील्ड एंड इंटरेस्टिंग बिकॉज आई एम गोइंग टू टेक यू टू वन ऑफ द मोस्ट पॉपुलर टूरिस्ट स्पॉट्स ऑफ वैंकूवर ब्रिटिश कॉलम्बिया टूडे वी आर एट कैपिलनो सस्पेंशन ब्रिज पार्क विच इज अ वेरी पॉपुलर टूरिस्ट डेस्टिनेशन स्पॉट ऑफ वैंकूवर वाई नॉट बिकॉज देर आर सो मेनी थिंग्स टू डू इन दिस पार्क Hello everyone welcome back to another fun filled family vlog yes today we are at Capilano Suspension Bridge Park and if you are here in Vancouver or around British Columbia you must be knowing that this is one of the uh, top and uh, mostly visited tourist destination of Vancouver British Columbia so yes please stay tuned with us as we explore this uh, uh, top destination spot of Vancouver and let's find it out what makes it this amazing place and what makes it to the top so there's lot of parking space with information center over there p parking facility there near the information center and there's guided sign everywhere so it's easy to track where the parking meter is you don't have to worry so here we are at the entrance and we need to go this way to the bridge and then here's the cliff walk is a very beautiful place very stunning place stay with us till the end of the vlog are you looking for some dinosaurs here is it so let's find some there's prehistoric sea animals here yes you're expecting to see some prehistoric sea animals here? yes tojo you like this place let's go let's move on let's explore and find out what makes it a popular tourist destination spot Our next point of attraction is the Kia Pelano, and if you are wondering what is that, so let's take a peek into British Columbia's uh, indigenous peoples' lives. Yes, the indigenous peoples—they are kind of having a close relation with uh, woods and forests. So let's peek in and see what their lives looks like. I just love these amazing structures, and yes, this is definitely a must-visit spot. with lot of green trees woods yes. oh, 
son aigle, ni bon jour au montagne. Je suis seul. Finally, we are going to the Capilano Suspension Bridge. So finally, we made, made it to the other side of the suspension bridge. First, we need to settle down a little bit since there's too much of crowd today because of the nice weather. We hardly see such wonderful weather, wonderful summer in Vancouver. This is the end of our scavenge hunt. The starting is up there at the treetops. Okay. 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 So let's see. Did you do it? Let's see. 25 degrees. Yes, it's sunny. See? So once you complete this, oh, nice. you are going to Rainbow claim your trout. prize. Good job. Here. See? It says awesome. So you can keep it if you want you or can recycle. Claim your prize here. And your prize oh, is a sticker. Oh, no, not a sticker. It's a wristband, but it's really cool. Did you find a T-Rex here? No, not yet. I find the prehistoric sea animals. You did? Yes. That's interesting. So let's take an ice cream break. I used to be my coffee. Ice cream coffee? Fun? Prehistoric animals here in the woods. So it's kind of different kind of feeling here in the woods. It's a log house. We are sitting under yeah, the log house. It's kind of a log house. And we are in the, in the middle of a jungle. Yeah. In the middle of a jungle, it's kind of feet of feeling. A log house in the treetop. Tojo found so many dinosaurs. Tojo today. is trying to find and track some dinosaurs here. Probably he's planning to take one back home, right, Tojo? And Mega is quietly having the ice cream now. Yes. And I'm having it too. I'm having it too. Rainforest. 
Yes. Thank you. We are having a Jungle feeling Jungle. of rainforest here, and there's so much of history in so uh, regarding the suspension bridge and the rainforest trees here. There are so many things to do in this park. There's nature, there's fun, there's restaurant, there's food, anything for all age and any age. So you will find a lot of fun. So I'm sure if you are here as a couple, single, with your friends, family, with kids, there's activities for any age and all age. And this is going to be uh, an amazing adventure for all of us. So you are definitely going to get the feeling of the perfect rainforest here. This is such a beautiful place. We are definitely liking this nature boardwalk. So there's boards in between the nature and trails, wooden trails that are made, carved or paved in between the woods. So when you get to do activities with your family and kids in between the nature, there this is something um, I have I just have no words. This is something unparalleled, right? because of this current pandemic situation we always look for activities within the nature and yes capilano suspension bridge is something of that sort where you will find a lot of activities fun nature scenic beauty and everything so that is why it makes it a popular destination spot and believe me there are a lot of events going on in different seasons like valentine's day during the winter there are light festivals so there's a lot of events Dinosaurs. So many dinosaurs are are these dinosaurs? Yes. They are prehistoric. They are prehistoric? Yes. <laughs> That's great. Prehistoric means water dinosaurs. Is it? Yes. Okay, then let's go and find some prehistoric dinosaurs. Let's move on. Let's go. We find too much sea animal. The sea animals going heading back to home.
so friends we are literally lost in between the woods and we are not able to figure out how to go back to the suspension bridge and the cliff uh, the cantilever cliff so we figured it out the way we came here we will go back the same way and then into the suspension bridge near the entrance from where we will take the cliff cantilever cliff so this is kind of an adventure it's a kind of magic maze and we are loving it we are literally enjoying it and also if you are planning your visit to capilano suspension bridge please make sure please ensure that when you pay your parking you just note down the parking spot number so what we did is that there is uh, that app based parking here in the park which is valid till 3 hours you can only book the parking for 3 hours then you have to go into the app to extend it so make sure that you remember that number to extend your hours in that app so but unfortunately we didn't uh, take a note of that and we lost the number so probably we have to go back before 3 hours So I'm, I'm just not able to walk. Oops. Bridge is literally shaking. It's, it's too wobbly. It's too wobbly. You just cannot stand without holding something. So you need to hold something. This is definitely a kind of adventure. So guys, this is a must visit place if you are here in Vancouver or planning your visit in Vancouver. Tojo, we, we made it, right? Are you scared anymore? Tojo is a brave one. So guys, finally we made it to the other side of the bridge. I mean, the point where we started actually. So we just came back through the suspension bridge. And as you noticed, it was not my hand that was shaking. It was literally the bridge. I was not able to stand without holding any of the edges. So this is kind of a very wonderful adventure. But if you are with small kids, then you have to take extra uh, precaution and uh, hi what i have found is that this is a wonderful place to take some nice great stunning instagram photos and reels definitely so don't miss that out if you are ever here in capilano suspension bridge and if you are not then plan your next visit to vancouver british columbia and a must visit spot is the capilano suspension bridge because there are so many things to do here so now our next spot is the uh, cantilever cliff. Tojo and Mega both tired. So we are kind of taking a sh short break. So like a road ashore. Hallelujah. Like a road for shore. Hallelujah. Sister had to trim the same. Sister Hell to dream the same Hallelujah Who's this, Tojo? Who's this? Can honey on the other side? Yes. Hallelujah. Like a road upon the shore. Hallelujah. Like a road. Hallelujah. Like a road. Hallelujah. There's an old song by the road of the show. This one from Bob Dylan. How many roads must a man walk before you call him a man? How many seas must a man walk in the sea? How 
many times must the cattle with all their four and the The answer, my friend, is the so finally, I don't know what's the time. It's crossed three in the uh, afternoon. It's way past our lunch time. We are very tired. Our kids are tired, and uh, kids were hungry. So we thought of taking a small break and have some food and lunch. So we are kind of waiting for our beep or buzzer to beep. So the concept is that when our food is ready, the buzzer is going to beep, and then you have to go there and uh, uh, collect your order. So we are waiting for our food. We are all very tired and hungry. And Dojo is kind of waiting for this beep or buzzer. So it's going to beep when our food is ready. The security officer is very helpful. Even we actually forgot the parking spot number. So he helped us in extending the hours. So we are safe. So we can still cover the cliff that we are we were thinking of. So but first we need to have some food. So we took took a kind of break. So the wait for the food is too long. We have been waiting for past 30 minutes but still our order is not ready. So this is again a point to be noted if you are planning your visit here in Capilano Suspension Bridge. So I don't know we were waiting for such a long time and after such a long wait we actually found out that they have missed our order and now they are telling we are going to refund you back. I, I was carrying some food with myself, so that kind of saved us. Finally, we got our food. Tojo is busy eating fries and uh, you should keep yourself hydrated especially during the summer because there is this is a planned part you will definitely get a restroom somewhere around so now finally we are heading towards that cliff walk so here are a few points to be noted and yes this is another important thing to notice that this is not a stroller friendly park because it's very narrow and at certain points it's quite steep so this is definitely not something uh, that you can bring your stroller here so it is not at all a good idea to bring your stroller this is the cantilevered cliff that I was talking about on one side you will get to see the granite uh, cliff and on the other side it's the Capilano uh, Canyon so this the view is amazing it's beautiful so this is a narrow cliff walk very scary it's so narrow and it's literally hanging and it's cantilevered and it's pretty much free hanging this is definitely very narrow and scary but we are just loving it very adventurous spot you should always, you should definitely do this. This is very scary. Ooh. You can literally look through these uh, bars. So we have to go farther way up. And we are literally tired. But this is a kind of adventure. So, friends, that's too many steps steep climb a lot of workout after the steep climb you can actually rest here there's a small peaceful resting area with the sounds of the water so a perfect place to take a pause and a perfect place to take some nice Instagram photos right I don't know how old this tree is actually. So after this steep climb, if your legs are tired, if you need to breathe, if you need to relax down, there's a cool spot here with the sounds of the water, a perfect place to take some rest, take a pause from this adventure. This is a beautiful place.
Should I wash my car at home or at a car wash? What uses more water, a lawn or a swimming pool? Vega, did you understand this point? Yeah. So this tells you how much water we actually waste in our everyday life and how much we can save this natural resource. So this is a very important message for all of us, not only for kids but for us grown-ups. So at every point, amazing viewpoints where you can take pictures, snaps and just spend a little bit of quiet time. So it seems it will go all the way around, it's literally planned and take you back to the deck where we started from. But you will definitely enjoy this boat walk. Between the nature and woods, a lot of oxygen. See the blue sky. Wow. There's a lot of sit and dine restaurants also in the park. If you just want to have sit down and have a nice family lunch or dinner. The lights are on but the sun is still there. It's 5 o'clock. It's not dark yet but our legs are tired, right Tojo? So there's a lot of restaurants and if you want to eat, uh, if you want to like have your dinner before heading back home, you can also do that. Now we are planning to go back home. We are on our way to the parking. No, don't go in the parking. Daddy's in the toilet. See, I found someone. Come, come, come. Have you this way? Yeah, uh, I have one here. What's that? Oh, so I made it so you can get it. Yeah, you wow. through the bridge. Oh, okay. That's great. <laughs> Awesome. So can we take nice two please? Yeah. One, yeah, two. Like yeah. Yeah, you Thank you so you much. Thank you. Tojo was really brave. So they gave you a certificate Tojo. So friends, I hope you liked our fam fun field family vlog today as we explored through uh, Capilano suspension bridge and uh, we got to see so many fun activities and fun spots and amazing viewpoints and it is well justified that why it makes it to the top tourist destination spot is huge and we have to come back every time to explore some new spots and the good thing is that we got the family pass or the annual pass what we got annual pass so anytime they, we can come. anytime so there are a lot of options uh, you can take a uh, annual pass and you can even come down drop in and get your tickets and yes if you're here as a single as a couple family friends with kids there's a lot of things to do and that is what makes it the most uh, or the top rated destination spot in Vancouver British Columbia so there's a lot to do there's a lot of activities there's a lot of things to see nature um, and beyond friends our legs are tired and it's around like around more than four or five hours that we are here inside the park but our excitement is not yet over so we will be back very soon again uh, uh, in Capilano Suspension Bridge Park and uh, with a diff in a different season with a different look definitely please do like share comment and subscribe and I will see you soon in my next video uh, but if you are planning to come down here so here are some suggestions that when you are making booking your parking spot please make a note of the number because that will help you to extend your hours of parking because you will definitely going to cover uh, you will not be able to cover the full park within three hours so it's obvious that you will cross that limit so make sure that you carry that number and yes if you are planning on any of the holidays national holidays public holidays or in the weekends or or uh, during uh, peak season like now when we are having such a nice sunny weather so there is you can expect a lot of crowd so make sure you are early here because of number of reasons one is definitely the parking spot and uh, the second one is uh, you will be able to take some wonderful pictures and instagram photos of uh, the suspension bridge and different uh, viewpoints if you are here 
early so that you can try and avoid the crowd. And yes, you will get uh, the sunlight to cover the most of the park areas and activities. And there are a lot of activities going on in this park in different seasons, as I was telling. So you can visit the website and uh, make a note of those if you are planning to come down on any specific occasion like Valentine's Day and um, the lights, winter lights, and Christmas. Uh, so there are a lot of events, a lot of lights and festivals going on all over around the year. Uh, in Capilano Suspension Bridge. So here is, yes, these are some of the points that I thought of making a note of uh, for you all if you are uh, planning your visit here soon.